Hello, this is Rich again. Um, just wanted to do an update on uh, the vehicle that we just created just a few minutes back here. Um, I've actually uh, figured out what the problem was. It's something very simple. Um, just as in real life, when something, when the a car, if tires are way too close together, if these tires are here and these tires are here, uh, you're going to end up having it tilt back and forth, back and forth. Very simple solution. Um, I should have known this before. I feel like an idiot. But back in here, I just basically took these tires, put them more to the front, took these tires, put them more to the back, um, and then reset all my X forms. Um, and, re and reset all my X forms. Um, then I just re-exported and then uh, deleted the object and brought it back. Um, jump right in game. Well, first of all, I do want to show you um, um, another issue. Um, not another issue. Um, I've also made um, every object still has its uh, pivot in the, in the center, um, but I basically raised the entire vehicle and made the tires uh, level with the ground. It's not required, but um, just do that anyways. And then just reset your X forms and then export. That's what I've done here. Nothing changed since before, um, except for the speed. So what I'm gonna do is uh, show you about that. Uh, let's go here. Let's go on a little hill. Everything works perfect now. I, I did test it just to make sure. But um, simulate physics on object. Bam, you can see it's perfect. Everything lines up the way it's supposed to because we uh, physically placed it inside the world. Let me just go in here and um, F to go inside and uh, just move around. Let's go off some hills and stuff. Vehicle stays nice and firm, doesn't tilt forward, doesn't tilt back like it did before. It's really nice. Um, if you notice, let me just get a nice flat ground. The incredible speed at which I'm allowed to move uh, because I set the speed as high as I did. There you go. Um, sorry for the short little video, but I, I figured it out, and I figured uh, since you guys listened to that whole freaking thing, you guys might want an update on how to solve it. But that's it. Because uh, physics does simulate the real world uh, physics, um, you can't do stupid stuff that you can't do in real life. Um, because, you know, it does simulate real world actions. So having those two close together, just like in real world, it would, it would cause like a, like a seesaw type of deal. So uh, that's how you do it. Thank you, guys.